Hello, this is Jacob Butler with Bloom Gardens. I just got done uh, finishing installing my new DIY two bucket canister filter system for this uh, 48 gallon bow front tank I just got. Um, so I had some pieces from a canister filter that wasn't working anymore. So draw tube is just kind of set inside another one so that I can break, break the siphon if I need to. That helps em empty the tanks when I'm a want to change them out. <clears throat> so as it comes down here, it goes into this first tank, and then there's a, a tube that comes down here, and then it pushes the water up through. This is full of bio balls, and then I've got another draw tube here that uh, draws from about right here. That way, it doesn't fill all the way up with water. It leaves a little bit of air there. Uh, these gamma seal lids have a tendency to leak a little bit uh, if completely full and under pressure so I want to keep a little air in there. Uh, then it comes up over here and this is a swirl filter so it's got a 90 pointing at the side of the barrel or bucket so it'll spin and then coming up through the center I've got a draw tube with two sponge filters and one inch PVC with several holes drilled in it so that it draws from the center of the bucket. Uh, then I install the pump directly onto uh, the gamma seal lid. As you can see, I'm having a little bit of a leak right here. Uh, after tracking all the other leaks down, I'm down to that one, so uh, I went ahead and installed it in place because I can deal with that with everything else in here. Um, it's a pretty simple system. I think this is maybe a 362 gallon per hour, uh, or gallon per minute, maybe, gallon per hour. Um, and then it just comes up here, and I think I've got a pretty good flow coming from it. I've got the sprayer bar turned where it's just skimming right across the surface. And that's it.